Hi there, I am going to do my what's in my diaper bag video. My daughter is not here yet. Um, she'll be born very soon. I'm a this will be my third child, so I have a little bit of experience packing diaper bags. And I prefer to have a nice organized diaper bag. Um as opposed to just shoving everything in there and and whatnot. It's just the way I am. So I We'll show you my diaper bag. I have a Jujube Biaw. Um, it's the basic black and silver. So basically that my husband will carry it too. Um, it's got lots of little compartments and such. Here on the back is just this little back thing where the changing pad comes with it. And this is really cool because it's um, a memory foam changing pad. It's really nice. I was playing with it earlier, like pushing it down and... <laughs> I'm letting it go back up, but so that's really nice to have. And also, cool, the cool thing about on the Jujube is that they have um, crumb pockets or crumb whatever down here at the very bottom. There's holes, so when you your kids get older and they have snacks or whatever, you put your snacks in this back pocket, and if the snacks happen to leak or whatever, then you just push the crumbs out. Crumb drains, that's what they're called. So I'll put that back in there. Over here on the side, in the bottle pocket, it's got two bottle pockets, but we don't use bottles. Um, we have a really nice double layer um, receiving blanket, which will be, you know, obviously to cover the baby and keep the baby warm, but also it'll double as a um, nursing cover for me. The only time I use a nursing cover is when I'm in church, though. Everywhere else, we, um, we're proud nursers, so. Over here we have two burp cloths, goodness, two burp cloths right there. My kids don't tend to be very spit up -y, so two is usually sufficient. I have two shopping bags and then some pocket back clean linen from Bath and Body Works. Um, okay. Here is what they call the mommy pocket. Um, right now my stuff is still in my purse because like I said this little one isn't here yet. But there's plenty of room in here. There's a key fob to put your keys on. Um, I have in here, so far I have just a pen and a pack of gum. Um, but it has this little thing right here too that they say is for your sunglasses, but I will be using this for my iPhone because I don't want it to get scratched. And it's got a little zipper pocket in here too. But it's big enough for your, your wallet and your cell phone, your keys and chapstick and the little odds and ends you want to throw in there. Inside, on the inside of this flap is a little spot to put your pictures in of your kiddos. But um, I really don't do that. In here... Is this is supposed to be the changing station, but I'm not really using it like that. I have a gee whiz. Okay, in here I have a wet bag, Planet Wise wet bag, plus some um, plastic Ziploc bags, Lansano breast cleaning cloths, lots of nursing pads, and then here is the mesh shuttle. And what I keep. In here, what's this? Sorry, <laughs> I'm using my phone. So, I keep Wisp um, toothbrush thingies, Tylenol meltaways, mostly for my daughter, unscented hand sanitizer for my husband, sanitary napkins for me. And then this little baggie is, oops, sorry about that. This little baggie is just first aid stuff. Um, I have little noses, allergen blocker. My 11 year old has allergies. I also have Neosporin with pain relief, Benadryl, two little things of Aquaphor, various sizes of um, band aids, alcohol swabs, Pepto Bismol, and moist wipes. And that's usually the kinds of stuff that I carry with me. I don't carry baby Tylenol with me because I figure if my baby has a fever and we're out, then um, we're just going to come home. 
before. I hope you guys don't get like sick from <laughs> watching cameras move like that. I do. So, but sorry about that. Okay, so inside, for the first two weeks of her life, we will be using disposables. Um, simply because she won't fit into her cloth diapers just yet. So I have disposable diapers, diaper wipes, and a little travel case. But I took them out and I put them in a Ziploc so that they wouldn't um, dry out before we got to use them. And this is just a little sample package of diaper wipes as well. I'm a really light packer, by the way. And here's the extra change of clothes. Uh, it's a baby sleeper. And then I have a onesie and a matching hat and a pair of socks and a pair of scratch mittens. That's it for that. Here is my nursing thingy. And what it is is um, I hook this around my neck. And I hook these little bottom suspender clips to that uh, blanket right there. And it acts as, you know, a nursing cover just really quick. And like I said before, the only place I'm going to use this is at church. Um, so I didn't see the need in spending $30 for a nursing cover, and I'm only going to use it once a week. Boogie wipes. I use these for my 11 and 4 year old, and we absolutely love them. However, you should be aware, these are not 100% natural. Some people are like, oh, they're all natural, saline, whatever. No, they're not natural. But they're still good, and they, if your kids have, you know, sensitive skin, it won't, irritate their face using it on their face like some diaper wipes will. Just put that back in there. And then I have two little pockets right here for whatever I decide to fill them up with once the baby gets here, but I can't imagine putting anything else in there. Like I said, I'm a pretty light packer when it comes to diaper bags. But that's it. That is all that I have in my diaper bag. If you have any questions or comments or whatever, just leave me a message to let me know. Thanks. Bye-bye.